Just who is Georgina Cartwell? Who indeed? While the YA fantasy author has won numerous awards for her first two novels, she has never made a public appearance. Breaking news, Georgina Cardwell has announced on social media that she is two weeks away from completing her third novel. Mom, can you maybe buy me an extra month or two? I mean, isn't that what agents are for? Darling, you signed a contract. I suggest you go upstairs and start packing because I booked us on a 10-day writing retreat. Really? An olive farm? My name is Ben Pulley. I am the owner, but I'm also going to be your guide on your journey through the wonderful world of olive oil. Right. Bad news. Olive flies have gotten into the crop. Not going to be producing a lot of oil this year. Okay, Mom, I'm just not well, one of those people who can wake up and sit down and start working. And... <sighs> well, then we will just find somebody who is. You help her finish her manuscript, and in exchange, we will use her influencer status to help give this place some much-needed PR. To figure out a solution, I first have to diagnose the problem, and that means seeing your work environment. Blanket for it. Well, no, it's actually more like a blanket mausoleum. The blindfold lets you block out external stimuli and access your subconscious. You are Georgina Cartwell. <laughs> I am just Mel, the girl who apparently can't write anymore. Instead of forcing you to write today, let's go outside and see if inspiration strikes you that way. That's good. All right, you can ease up on the reins a bit. Yeah, but how do I drive her? I, or, I mean, steer? We just need to keep the words flowing. Make sure your mind is in the optimal creative state. You might be the last person in the world I would have thought could dance. That would make two of us. We're being spontaneous. <laughs> go! She knew she wasn't making the journey alone. You, Mel, you're amazing. You, not Georgina Carpo. The third and final book of the Moonlight Magic trilogy was completed during my stay here at the Babbling Brook Farm. And I will be publishing it under my real name. Would you like to dance? Always.